It's time for a segment that we call I Am Indie, where we highlight Hoosiers who are making yes. a positive impact in our community. That's right. She's definitely on Santa's nice, nice yes. list. Nancy Armstrong. Nancy, your story is just incredible because so many of us have plastic bags around the house. And you know, you think, oh, I don't know what to do with these. Well, you've certainly found a use. What have you created here? Yes, well, these are sleeping mats for the homeless. And um, obviously, they're made out of plastic bags. I've been told it takes 600 to 1,000 bags to make one mat. So think 600. of the impact that has on the environment. On the environment. Wow. Yes, uh, on the environment. Right. And it's just a very simple thing to do. You just start with your plastic bags, fold them, you cut them into slices, okay. make them into rings like this, All right. and then you just tie these together to make what's called plastic yarn. Plarn. 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 I've never heard of Plarn, plarn before. That's fun. Mm -hmm. Plastic yarn. Yes. Okay. And then you just take a crochet hook. This is a huge one. Yeah. A size Q. That's big. And you just start crocheting. This is going to be my Colts one. Oh, fun. Oh, yes, the Colts that. one. Wow. So they recommend making it three by six feet okay. long. Okay. And as you can feel, it's cushiony. Yeah. The beauty of this is that it is waterproof. It doesn't mold or mildew. Nice. If it gets dirty, sure. you can just rinse it off. Yeah. Wow. And then we just make a tie that goes around it so you can wow. wrap it up and carry it, and it's very transportable. That's amazing. I, I gotta ask, what inspired you? to do this. Obviously, I could imagine that you were crocheting, you know, for years. I like to do this type of thing, What yes. made you jump into this? A friend of mine at work told me about something that her church was doing. They were making these. Okay. And I thought, oh, I can do that. Yeah. You know, that's something I can do. And it takes no time at all. The hard part is cutting up all the bags and making the plarn. I have a friend, Deb Huff, who does all that part for me. Oh, okay. So that's, it's nice to have a team. It's yeah. nice to have somebody helping you with that. And um, so she does all of that. I do the crocheting. Wow. It takes so maybe cool. a week to 10 days to make a mat. Okay. So, yeah, it takes some time. Yeah. Well, yeah. and I have wow. to give a thank you to my neighbor, Heather Purvis. She yes. saw you, I think, in a ra waiting room doing yes. this. And she yes. said, wow, mm -hmm. what are you doing? Mm -hmm. So Heather, thank you for telling us yes. about Nancy because people can actually help out if they wanted to donate their plastic oh, bags. Yes. And this is something that any crocheter, any craft-minded person can do on their own. Yes. You know, it's nice to have a group. You don't have to have a group. You can yeah. do it on your own. That's great. Yes. So if people have, I mean, I know, I know oh, we've I got a so many ton plastic of plastic bags, bags mm -hmm. sitting around. Yes. Where, uh, where can we go to donate them? What's the process? You know what? I just, I just do it from our own grocery stores, okay. you know, yeah. and I just, um, collect them at home and just do it at home. Okay. I love so, that. Yeah. You we know, got Wheeler Mission's website that's yes. been popping up because I know you work with them. I donate these to Wheeler Mission that's when great. I am done. Yes, uh huh. And um, so, yeah. That's amazing. So Nancy. fun. I love seeing Man. the process. Yeah, one person can make a difference. Yes, you know? that's yeah. right. Can. And you can too. And yeah. it's twofold. You know, you're helping Hoosiers in need and then you're keeping all of this out of the landfill. So yeah, absolutely. Thank you for great. showing us you're how this is done. Welcome. I loved seeing the pictures as well. And, yeah. and you're just incredible, Nancy. Thank, well, thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks, Nancy. Yeah.